Hey guys, what is up? MK Gaming here. Today I am playing War Thunder and today we are playing the game right after its recent patch. That is right. The Americans have now the new P47 Thunderbolt at tier 5, which is really good because finally America has a dedicated 5.0 fighter. In case you're wondering, this is what the Americans have to use in a 5.0 battle rating. Are you kidding me, War Thunder? Now the reason why particularly uh, P-51 Mustangs and also other fighters in the American lineup have been down tiered is mainly simply because people just don't know how to use their planes. They just don't. You find P-51 Mustangs turn fighting a, a zero and then complaining, oh why isn't the plane turn turning the way I want it to? Well that's because the plane's not meant to be turned like that mate. And also, when Gaijin sees this, Gaijin realizes, oh, okay, this plane's not doing so well. There's a lot of deaths coming up with this plane in the realistic battle. I guess we have to lower the uh, battle rating to make sure that uh, people are able to play it. And then suddenly you find the P-51 Mustang at a 4.0 battle rating. It's insane. This plane used to be really, really, really good. I used this plane quite a lot. I mean, not this plane, but I used the P-51 Mustang a lot. And what I do basically with it is simple. I squat up with a friend, because usually the Mustang handles better with the squad mate. And I climb. I make sure that I am high above. I make sure that altitude is my friend, because the plane handles slightly better at high altitudes. As compared to, uh, you know, certain low altitude fighters that handle perfectly down low. In a way, it's like this. If I were to use a bomber and turn fighter zero, and wonder why isn't my plane turning the way I want it to be? Why isn't the plane turning like a fighter? Well, it's quite simple. If you don't know how the plane handles, don't fly it. Or at least if you don't know how the plane handles, learn about it. It's that simple. We have custom battles, we have practice, we have everything and you guys don't want to use it? Hmm, problematic right there. Now enough about this rambling session, I'm now going out for this guy, Vector777, he's using the year 2. I am now going to be firing the M3 guns, which don't do so well, but it's okay. Climbing back up, don't want to lose my altitude to that year 2. After all, he does have, Jesus Christ, he has 6 planes. Alright guys, this is also another problem. You guys gotta know when to engage and what to leave behind. You see, right now, there's practically what? Give and take six planes down there? Six planes. Three of them could be defending C right now. And of course, this P-63 does not see himself. He is just going to the hornet's nest. Yep. Now, just coming up for this Spitfire. Hopefully, the J2M doesn't miss. He did. Now, hopefully, I don't miss. Oh, my God. All right, M3. Oh, come on! All right, turning the plane back up like this. Turning it up. He's out. Oh, something's behind me. It's a P2. Two planes high above me right now. I'm just making sure that they don't do anything. Frisky. Now I'm chasing this PE2. I see a yak time coming towards my left. Just gonna do a quick burst. Right, turning, turning, turning. Push down hard on the stick and let's go. Yak 9 is pushing up to the vertical. Interesting move. I think I got his coolant. Now I'm not gonna turn fight him first. Just pushing it up. Year 2 is there. And the Yak is out. There is also a Typhoon coming towards. I might go for the Typhoon. Do not look at me. Do not look at me. Do not look at me. Good. You're not looking at me. God damn it. Okay. Combat flaps on. And Kapoya. Nope. Got a critical hit. Of 
All right, climbing back up. Turning the plane. Surprisingly, we're having a pretty good game uh, with the F-82. All right, that year two is coming. Uh oh. All right, I might need to land. Yeah, I think I'm good for a while more. Something else is behind me, it's the yak. Critical on you, got your cooling system, turning back out. Reloading the guns. I-185 coming in. Moving up, moving up. We are coming in hot. Sever, come on, turn, turn. All right, might need to land this girl down. Uh, let's see what we can do. All right now, hit the brakes. Don't push up on the elevator just yet. And now we wait. It's going to be an interesting game. Surprisingly, I survived. Okay, hitting up the web. Let's do this. Yak 9's out. We might actually win this because we have a lot of like targets that are being killed right now. Now oh, there's an enemy Spitfire. Just gonna tag that. I'm gaining altitude at even on the deck. Uh, sorry, I'm gaining speed on even on the deck, which is really good. Really, really, really good. Okay, so that Spitfire is hell-bent on that B-25, which will make my life a little bit more easier. And I had to jinx it. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Alright, turning back, turning back. Alright, there is that I-185 coming in. Alright, turning in hard. Gonna engage that BF-109. And that 109's out. Now back to the 185. Checking my six. And he's out too. Alright. This is gonna be a very quiet game, I see. Oh shit, there's a fuck wolf. And he is booming and zooming. He knows what to do. Oh shiza. God damn it. All right, it's back to the base again. Shit. <sighs> Luckily, the plane is uh, its not too bad. It can actually survive without the center wing. Oh, there's a Mustang coming up. I'm gonna have to engage that first before I land. Come on, come on, Cirillo. Turn, turn, turn. Just scaring this Mustang. Come on. There we go. Bomber rescue. Drop speed. Wait, what? Another plane? Oh, man. Uh, uh, I'm not sure what to do right now. Um, I'm leaking fuel. All right, he's out. Oh, oh, yak nine, yak nine, yak nine, yak nine. Come on, come on. I really prefer the M3 cannons or the machine guns. Come on. Oh, there we go. He's out as well. All right. 
We can win this. We can win this. Come on. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh my god, my combat flat's on. Alright, we won! That's a good game indeed! Now, uh, we basically got... What What number did we get? 6th uh, place? 7th place, sorry. 7th place with 5 kills and 4 assists. 0 deaths in an F82. Of course, uh, I've not really played this plane, so forgive me. I don't really have much on... Uh, well, installations on it. I am planning to get this one uh, to have the additional gun pod, which I heard is really beast mode. So I'm just going to get the offensive 12 mm's and then head up for this one. And yeah, this plane, um, when I first got it, I remember I wasn't a big fan of it. I actually didn't like it. But now it's slowly growing into me. I like it. Just like it's... Uh, younger brother i would say the p61 or the it's older brother the p61 when i first got it i wasn't too keen on it but then when i started flying it and playing it safe and studying and understanding the plane it began to become a beast of its own all right guys thanks for watching the video if you like what you saw hit like and subscribe for more videos in the future till then i'm out